Welcome to another Tips and Tricks. Do you need to schedule rotation or maintenance of equipment around actual runtime? This will help you plan maintenance based on how many hours your equipment has been operating. By monitoring the status, anytime the equipment operates, the time will be documented. We'll start by going to Manage and clicking Create. We're going to scroll down and select BT for Binary Totalizer. We'll call it MAU1 Runtime. Now we're going to hit the Create button. The BT window pops up and it will ask us for the monitored object. This is where we'll calculate for how long this object has been on or off. We'll use the status because we want to be able to calculate the runtime regardless of whether the DDC system turns it off or on. If somebody manually turns it on in the field, we would still get a status, so we can make sure that we document the runtime there as well. The default entry for decimal places is 1. This is measured in hours and tenths of an hour. Now we'll save this. As the equipment runs, this point will document how many hours it's been operating. If you want to reset this value, you can come back over to IntelliWeb and type BT into the search bar. We can select the binary totalizer that we just built, and we'll go up to Command and hit Reset Object. That will put the runtime back to zero. If there was any runtime showing, it would start calculating it again, and it would start tracking the runtime from the beginning. Thanks for watching another Tips and Tricks. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the notification bell to be notified when new videos are released. If you'd like more content like this, let us know in the comments below.